Yesterday's curry was amazing, although it did fill me up quite a lot. Um, I am trying to eat literally whatever I see at the moment because I am bulking. I'm still trying to get to the 105s. Um, I currently weigh 101.9 kilos. I lit literally weighed myself two minutes ago. Um, and I put it onto this app here. Um, it says I'm 18.4% body fat. I don't really agree with that because... Um, I've actually lost body fat when I've been putting on weight, so that just doesn't make any sense. Um, so yeah, I'm three kilos away from the weight category at the moment, um, which sort of brings me on to the video um, and what my goals and plans are um, at the moment um, and what my uh, training is looking like at the moment. So um, a couple of weeks ago, um, I went for a new squat, one rep max. Um, if you've seen my previous videos, you'll see that I would have failed that. Um, so I went for 232.5 kilos. On a different day, I probably would have got it. Um, there was just different variables that played into that um, for the reason that I missed the lift. Um, in the process of squatting that, I managed to slightly pull my adductor. Um, I didn't realize it straight away, but a couple of days later, um, I definitely felt um, the area was getting very tight. Um, I then went into the gym probably two days later, so what was that, Monday, Tuesday, when? three days later, I went into the gym three days later um, and went to do some pore squats. So I didn't think this would be an issue at all, I just thought the adductor would probably ease up. Um, got to my top set of 155 kilos and my adductor was in absolute agony. I felt it pulling, I felt like I was gonna do some serious damage to it, so I was meant to do five sets of three, but I ended up doing two reps. Um, I then lowered the weight to 140 kilos just to see um, if slightly lighter weight um, affected it as well and it did. So that pretty much was a write off uh, for that session. I felt like complete shit to be honest with you. Um, I said to Sam who I was training with, I give up, I am just going home, um, my doctor is hurting too much. Um, so weirdly. The next day, as you would have seen pre in previous videos, I went in and I actually managed to pull a new deadlift PB um, of 262.5 kilos and actually bench a new bench PB of 147.5 kilos as well. So that's just what I'm gonna talk about in this video, just where my squat is at the moment and my bench and my deadlift. So at the moment, my deadlift doesn't really seem to be affected too much with this slight strain in my uh, adductor, neither obviously does my bench. Um, I am getting a lot of tightness in my pec, um, so since I've hit the new personal best, I am sort of deloading, I suppose, this week. I haven't hit nearly as heavy as um, I would do otherwise. Um, squats, however, have been um, a completely different story. Um, a week after I failed the 232.5 kilo um, and the 155 kilo pull squats. Um, I went into the gym with the intention of aiming towards 160 kilo because I thought a few days rest, I should be fine. Um, I couldn't even get above 100 kilos. I got 
100 kilos and again it was just hurting so I went down to 60 kilos and just did some really slow tempo squats just to uh, do the movement more than anything and try and give it a little bit of a stretch um, but yeah obviously very frustrating at the moment um, not being able to properly squat um, so a few days after that um, I gave it some proper rest and some proper rehab. I was doing the proper um, corrective exercises and stretches on the adductor. Um, I went into the gym. The plan was actually just to do some split squats, um, but again, I wanted to just see. I, I was obviously being very sensible with it. I was slowly building up with the squats, and if I felt any pain whatsoever, I stopped. Um, and I managed to get back up to 160 kilos completely pain free. Um, so that's pretty much where my squat is at the moment, pain free. I didn't want to go any heavier than that with the risk of obviously damaging it again. So at the moment we're just rebuilding again. Um, I don't know what my deadlift is at the moment because I skipped my deadlift session yesterday because um, I didn't want to risk injury anymore. So I just want to have a few days off now to really recuperate. So since hitting the bench personal best of 147.5 kilos, I've basically just been maintaining that. Um, I hit 125 kilos for a triple really comfortably uh, with some back down sets after that. Um, and then a few days later I was doing 115 kilos for tempo bench. Again that felt okay. Um, my pec, like I said, has been feeling very tight um, so I'm just being quite cautious with that so I've had um, a couple of days rest now I'm gonna rest again tomorrow on Sunday um, and then back in on Monday hopefully start to ramp up again I will probably aim to get a 180 kilo squat something like that and just sort of see how the adductor feels if it's complete completely pain-free then obviously we can start rebuilding again um, and start a new training cycle so yeah fairly straightforward video today guys um, just giving you an update of where I'm at body weight wise um, and training wise um, but yeah hopefully in the coming months there will be some new big personal bests I've obviously got some big goals going forward so uh, I can't wait for that anyway please leave the video a like if you've enjoyed it um, and I'll see you in the next one take care peace